sorry. I just lost track of time. If time is linear throughout the universe, how can it slip away? To begin, we must first dismantle the idea that there is a universal present. Time and space are cosmically linked. Massive objects like planets bend the fabric of space-time around them, slowing the clock down. We feel this slowing of time as gravity. Meaning time passes more slowly the closer you approach the core of a planet. In addition to mass, time is affected by speed. The faster an object travels, the slower it experiences time. These are the foundations of Albert Einstein's theories of relativity. The expansive scale of the universe also complicates the concept of the present. On Earth, when we gaze at the stars, we see the past. By the time their light reaches our eyes, it has already traveled across the universe for thousands of years, meaning that our now is their then. So you see, the concept of a universal present simply does not exist. And while it is evident that our now is different than that of a distant star, this localization of the present also applies on Earth, just to a smaller degree. For what we think of as one instantaneous earthly present is actually a matter of nanoseconds, which breaks down to an array of light cones, every event with its own unique past, present, and future. And as inhabitants of the Earth, this means that we too have our own unique present. This minute temporal difference is greatly magnified once subjectivity is introduced through the brain. Different areas of the brain are better suited towards measuring different durations, but there is no internal master clock responsible for all temporal calculations. All neurons have the ability to help tell time through the detection of patterns that are created when synaptic signals are fired. Chemicals in the brain further complicate one's internal perception of time. This is why emotion can have such a profound impact on internal temporal experience. For people diagnosed with bipolar, time can seem to slow down during depressive episodes and speed up during mania. Everyone experiences this sensation to some degree and therefore creates their own relationship with the passage of time. If the assumed linear timeline is experienced non-linearly, with everyone processing their own temporal experience, what is time to humanity? There is no one present, and there is no one way to tell time, so all that's left are people. The more we realize that there is only time as it relates to relationships, the more we can understand our relationship with time and the more we can begin to understand each other. So, can time slip away? Only in relation to those around us. In this manner, time is both individual and yet incredibly communal. For we may experience time on our own, but as a community, we strive to be in time together.